It's going to be a really tough decision selecting three singers to go through to the final in two weeks' time. As a former young chorister myself, I know all of the hard work and practice they've put in. But whatever happens, they really are a credit to their music teachers, their families and themselves. Before we hear the judges' decisions, here's a reminder of all five performances. Josie, oh my goodness, what purity. Absolute control, absolute simplicity, uh, right on top of it. I agree. Josie, for me, I loved that she looked at each of us individually, which is, I think, quite an experienced thing to do as a performer. Absolutely. I loved the tone and I enjoyed those, those top notes there. Leah has a real rich quality to her voice, which I love seeing in a mezzo-soprano. Oh, the the a voice like dark chocolate. Beautiful. Here was a worship song projected with a sense of belief, which is all important, um, with a voice I could listen to all day. Ruby, I thought, was such a confident singer. How beautiful love of feet of them. It was a strong voice. Really confident yes, sound, which is really nice to see in someone yes. of that age. I think she did really well, and it's clear she was really enjoying herself. I sensed that she was trying to pay attention to the words and to ensure that the words came through to the listener. The entire performance was one of glad tidings. It was a very difficult start for Alexandra because you've got to place that starting note very, very carefully. In some cases, I was worried just that the vibrato wasn't quite under control. But my goodness me, I would certainly mark her card as somebody to watch for in the years to come. I agree with you. Alexandra's got that great potential and I'm really excited to see what she'll do next. I think we may well be seeing her on the stage of the Royal Opera House in a few years' time. Alice made a very brave choice. It is a thing most this John Ireland solo is full of little twists and turns. One or two phrases are rather long and then the air supply is not going to carry one through. It's best to just put a breath there and make it sound as if you intended to breathe there. There was a purity in her voice that I love hearing, especially in that kind of music. And to me, she did really well. Well, I think you'll agree they are all very worthy semi-finalists. Well, I'm about to reveal who will be going through to the final, but before I do, judges, have you been impressed with what you've heard today? Bowled over. <laughs> Laura, what did you think? You all did so well today. You've done yourselves very proud. Beautiful music to listen to. Thank you. And Carl? Superbly musical performances from all five girls. Well done. Thank you, judges. Well... I have the decision here. In no particular order, the first girl who will be singing in the final is... Leah. <laughs> and the second girl finalist will be... Ruby. And our third girl going through to the final is... Josie! <laughs> well done to all of you girls and to Alice and Alexandra. Thank you so much. You've been so wonderful and it's been a pleasure to get to know you and I wish you all the best. And thank you to the judges. Thank you so much to Laura Wright, Carl Jackson, and John Rutter. Next week, Alla Jones will host the semi-final for the boys. Until then, goodbye. <laughs>